Hello everyone and welcome to a new episode from Solvi. So on a previous video on my channel I showed you how to get the voltage gain of an inverting uh, op amp. Uh, so in this video I'm going to show you a different type which is the non-inverting and also I'll show you how to get a buffer amplifier using the non-inverting type. So let's start by drawing the non-inverting so this is our op amp you have negative and positive and you have your feedback the output let's call this one uh, R2 this resistor and here we have R1 in the inverting amplifier we had R1 connected to the source while this time it will be connected to the ground while the source VN will be connected to the other side, to the positive side. So if you watched the previous video you would know that the current here equals zero and that the voltage here is the same. So we have on this node we have VI so definitely the voltage here equals VI2 so <coughs> since we have no current over here then this current I1 will equal the current I2 this current so what does I1 equals? I1 let's change the color <coughs> I1 equals no the current this time will be in the opposite direction sorry for that should be in this direction I do will be in this direction too or as you like it's the same so the current will be Vn mi minus 0 which is Vn over R1 and since we said that uh, what does I2 equal I2 equals V output this one is V output minus V input over R2 I2 equals V output minus V input over R2. So <coughs> we said that both of them are equal. So VI over R1 equals V output minus VI over R2. Let's delete this all and show you how do we continue this calculation to get the voltage gain so we said that vi v input over r1 equals v output minus v input over r2 so uh, we need to calculate v output over v input so we take this one the other side so it will be r2 over R1 and bring this one over here equals V output minus V input over V input so we divide <coughs> this division over V uh, so it will be V output over V input minus V input over V input which will equal V output over V input which is the gain that we, uh, we want to calculate minus 1 so we want to keep this gain on one side so V output over V input which is the voltage gain equals R2 over R1 plus 1 so this is the gain for the non-inverting so from this relation the gain equals R2 over R1 plus 1 uh, what's the concept of the buffer? the buffer is any electronic circuit that will give us a gain of 1, exactly 1. So in order to, so we already have this one, so in order to make this relation equal to 1, or this expression equals 1, then we have to make R2 equals 0. So R2 equals 0, the resistance that is that equals 0, means a short circuit. So in order to build a buffer, this is the circuit that we will end up with, using an op amp. So B buffer
So it will be the same circuit but with R2 the I, the ground R1 connected to the ground and R2 we will have it R2 equals 0 which means a short circuit so this is the buffer uh, the buffer is such an important electronic circuit because whenever you're having like more than circuits all connected they, they are first separate and whenever so uh, you need a specific output over here so uh, for example you get a specific voltage from this one and from this one and if if you imagine that you input this voltage to this one you will get specific voltage and if you take this voltage input to this one you will get your result but whenever so this is like when when you don't connect them all together when you connect a voltage the voltage that you will get from this one to this one but whenever you really connect them all together you will end up having like you will not have your output you might have zero or some output which is less than the output that you wanted to get so this is where the buffer is used you connect between them using a buffer because a buffer will take the voltage and cancel the loading effect of the other circuits around this system and it will uh, your your system will work fine you'll have your output so buffers are very important for electronics and this is it this is how you calculate the gain for the inver non inverting uh, op amps and this is how you get a buffer uh, I hope you like it this video if you did and you understand the concept of the op amps and probably in the future I'll be posting different types of op amps so keep up with the channel and if you have any specific type that you would like to see how to calculate its voltage gain you can write its name down below and i'll google it and i'll show you how to calculate its gain uh, and if you have any other question related to any topic on my channel you can comment it down in the comment section below and i'll solve it definitely in a following video and don't forget to like this video and subscribe to the channel see you in the next video Bye. Thanks for watching.